Gordon and Diesel 10 had a punishment to being very foolish of themselves. So, they were shopping at Scrapyard one morning, uh, one night, when the controller and his brother walked up. The contr his brother walked on, no wait. The controller walk, walked in front of Gordon, and his brother walked in front of Diesel 10. But first, the controller spoke severely to Gordon. Gordon, he said, this wouldn't have happened if you wouldn't have been so silly. I know, sir, said Gordon. I'm sorry, sir. You better be, he said, because I'm taking you out of the scrapyard. Yes, said Gordon. Wait, no. What? Said the what? Said his brother. Yes, you don't want to leave. Why don't you want to leave, Gordon? Because, said Gordon, I'm not liking it here. I like the work. You don't like the work here? Like on your friends? Well, mm, to tell you the truth, not really. The driver was. Sh the controller was shocked. <gasps> you take that back. These are your friends, you know, and you're like. So selfish, Gordon. I can't believe you. I just cannot believe you. Me neither, said his brother. Oh, whatever, said Gordon. I had enough. He was so cross, he blew steam at the controller. The controller started coughing. <coughs> then he fell. Whoa, he said, Gordon, stop now. No, I won't, said Gordon crossly. G -g -g Gordon, said his brother, stop now. No, I won't, said Gordon. He blew steam at him. Gordon blew steam at his brother too. <coughs> he landed on the track. What? That was amazing. I didn't know steam could be that, like, strong, said Diesel 10. Well, it can be, said Gordon. Come on, guys, let's go. James, move out of the way. Sorry, said James. Gordon, he said, you shouldn't be like this. You know, these are your feet, mate. Whatever, said Gordon. I had enough! Percy already knew the routine as the diesels were going already. And then the diesels were going too. <clears throat> You better not go nowhere, said Scar Louie. Be quiet, said Gordon. You're not the boss. Thomas and Percy got back their sightings. What? Somebody go stop them! You're just gonna let them get away? He said crossly. You're just gonna let them get away? He said crossly. I'll go after them. I'll go after them, said James way over there. Get him, James! Get him! But they were going way, but they were going way too fast. Gordon, Diesel, Ten, and Dodge went one way. And Ari, Bert, and Diesel win another. Oh no! But James will go and after them. They went two ways! But we're gonna be too late, he said. Alright, get the one. Alright, get the one that's the most wildest. Get the one on the left, which is the one on Gordon's on. Let them be. No, said James. You never know. Ugh. Don't worry, I'm here to the rescue, said Thomas. 
All right, Sir James, this is a deal. You, I go right. Oh, sorry. I'll go left and you go straight. You have that? Yes, I do. C copy that, Sir Thomas. All right, Sir James, let's go. Thomas went right past James in a heartbeat. But it was much harder catching the, the, the one James, the group James was catching because they were much, much quicker. Because Gordon was an express engine and Diesel 10 has always been faster. And Dodge was like one of the fastest engines on the um magical Magic Railroad. railroad. It's an old pioneer set. Well, said Gordon, is it here it is, Henry, who doesn't want to join me. Phew, I am surprised. Gordon, said Toby, go away, now. I'm sick of you. I want you to go away, or you just, ugh, get off this island. I'm not playing with, I'm not playing today, said Toby. I'm not moody, you know it, he said, or I'm telling. Telling who, laughed Gordon. I'm telling the controller. Well, he has steam. He said, <laughs> said a voice. What the? What in the world? He said, how did y'all get here so quickly? He said, magic, said the controller. Yep, said his brother, magic. Anyways, we will come and stop you, they said. Uh, no, you won't, said Gordon. <gasps> what did you just say, said his brother? No, you won't, said Gordon, who heard us. He bit Henry so hard that Henry was way out of control. Help, said Henry, help. And he crashed off the, and Henry crashed off the tracks. Oh, said Henry, that hurt. Goodbye, said Gordon. Yeah. Goodbye, little steamy. And they puffed away. Somebody stop them, said Duck. Fine, said Fine, said Duck. I'll stop them myself. And he went after him. No, Duck, said James. Go back, go back. Why? I'm going after them. Oh, fine, said James. Maybe we can go after them. The brothers copy that. Alright, we must... The, the, the uh, Roger that they said. <clears throat> Thomas was catching that up the angels, but since he was a tank engine, he was slower than them at speed. This is not working, said Thomas. This is not working. But then the diesel stopped. Thomas stopped right behind him, but he but he didn't go as close. Then, they said, Edward, can you please move? No, said Edward. If y'all want to be with Gordon, then I'm not moving, he snapped. Edward, said Bert, can you please move out of the way? He's asking you nicely now, said Bert crossly. No, I will not. No matter how acting, no matter how nicely you act, I will not move. <laughs> said Ari, that's it. We're just going another way, he said. I will stop you, said Edward. I'm stopping them, said Thomas. Well, Thomas, said the con said the Diesel. Ah! Diesel biffing the Thomas so hard, but Thomas had his brakes on, fortunately. Diesel biffed in the Thomas so, so hard that Diesel went up on Thomas. And Diesel just crashed off the line and then followed Bert. Then followed... That went on top of that went on top of Diesel and Abby, which had just magically tipped over. <laughs> oh, oh my god, said Thomas. This is hilarious. Hilarious, he said. He biffed the Diesel. <sighs> said Diesel. I hate you, Thomas. Thomas chuckled. Who cares, said Thomas? Everyone hates you. So you can hate all, you can hate us if you want, but we hate you for you hating. Soon they heard the, 
then then dodge. St However, then he dodged, stopped. Ah! Said duck. He was too late. Duck thought he was gonna be too late and crashed right into dodge. But what happened is dodge fell off the rail, then he bit Diesel Tank hard. Ah! Oh, said Diesel Tank. That hurt. He said, "What was that for, duck?" And then he smashed into Gordon again. Gordon went so fast that something was about to happen. Gordon, policy means this video must not be viewed for kids, for kids five and younger. Thank you. Gordon crashed into the station hard. The station was in complete, complete wreck. It looks like a scale tour, zero to a five tornado as an F4 on the Fujita scale, but an EF4 on the enhanced. Diesel 10 moved forward. But then he just came off the rails and tipped on his side. This hurt, said Diesel 10. The controller arrived. Well, guys, said the controller, I, I, I don't have anything else to say, he said, I really don't, I really don't, he said, I'm sorry, sir, said Gordon, sorry's not enough, said his brother, now, when Neville comes to pick you back up, y'all are going to sit in the scrapyard until you come out, you understand, or else, I will take, we will take the personal town on time of our out of our time and go scrap you at the smelters are both of y'all do you understand me he had yelled so loud that gordon and diesel 10 were speechless they couldn't say anything uh, the the brother's throat was now hurting ouch don't worry you did your best don't worry you've yelled at them you yelled at them good Ow. <coughs> Thank you. <coughs> Thank you, he said. <sighs> but then in the dis but then in the distance, they saw another huge wreck with three of the diesels. Wow. They said, I didn't know the diesels would have a such big wreck. But then magic would come. The next few weeks, the station was back in order, and the trucks were back, but they now had to settle one problem, the diesels and Gordon.